American classical education withdrawing its appeals in Tennessee. Chris O'Brien just heard from the governor following this big announcement. He joins us with a look at what the governor had to say. Alex Mark, good evening. He didn't say whether he would continue to support ACE, American Classical Education, in the future uh, or not. He was kind of just in the middle and talking about how he wants more options for families. Now, what I think is so important from this pullout from American Classical is that legislators sort of get off the hook here, right? They, they don't have to answer to their constituents whether or not they're going to support uh, American Classical in the future or should they have, uh, should there have been a vote coming up whether or not they'd support it. They don't have to answer to their local school boards. They don't have to answer to their constituents who were uh, either for or against it, right? So that's, I think, who got the big win here is those legislators. And I asked Bill Lee today, Governor Bill Lee, uh, whether or not he would support American classical education moving forward given its affiliation with Hillsdale and its president, Larry Arn. What I, what I really do support is uh, choices for parents for their children's education. Um, we have a number of charter management organizations in this state, 22, I believe. High quality charter public charter schools are an integral part of our state's public education system. 41,000, I believe, children are educated. Um, it's important to know that about 90% of those children are minority students. Uh, those families, those parents need to have options. Now, moving forward, this isn't the end, right? This is the end of the current controversy, uh, but American Classical Education released a statement today saying, we believe with complete conviction that there will be many future opportunities in Tennessee as there are in most of America. What does that look like moving forward? Well, you know, we're going to go ahead and find out in the coming months, and the coming years. Mark? A big development for sure. Chris O'Brien, thank you so much for your reporting. Now, in a statement, American Classical Acad Education said it believes there will be future opportunities in the state of Tennessee. It goes on to say ACE looks forward to applying for more charter schools where local parents, teachers and students looking for education alternatives. The statement, however, does not clarify directly if that means they will apply for more schools in the state of Tennessee.